Okay, so this is today's workout outfit. This top is from Gymshark and then the leggings are from Nike, if you can't tell. But yeah, I'm not sure what I actually want to do in the gym today. I haven't been in the gym for a while. I used to go twice a week regularly. And then since I've been revising for mocks, that's like gone out the window. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do, but we'll see. Okay, so I just got out of the shower and then changed into this jumper, which I literally have been wearing non-stop. And I've just finished my skincare and I'm going to do a little bit of makeup. Whilst doing my makeup, I'm also going to catch up with the latest episode of Euphoria. Episode 7, the one about Lexi's play. Um, if you've been watching season 2 of Euphoria, comment down below your opinions. But before I do that, I'm going to quickly introduce you guys to today's sponsor, which is NordVPN. Now, NordVPN is especially good for me when I watch Euphoria. Because watching Euphoria on a dodgy website means I get a lot of ads and pop-up ads. And little messages saying that I've got a virus and it always worries me when I'm watching Euphoria because I'm like so many people are telling me I've got viruses which is why a VPN is so important so if you don't know what a VPN is it basically just hides your IP address and your virtual location so NordVPN will make sure your data is always protected and for me NordVPN stops me from all these third parties accessing my data when I'm on websites that aren't so secure and also just on websites in general it just keeps my data private I'm not joking when I say NordVPN is so easy to use. You can literally just connect with one click. There's also over 5,300 servers in over 60 countries. So you can literally connect to a server wherever you are in the world. You connect to one closer to you for better speed or one far away if you want more content. So here you can see me using NordVPN. As you can see, it's so, so simple. I literally just click on the server I want to connect to. And NordVPN has amazing speed. It's proven that NordVPN is the fastest VPN out there. So I definitely recommend if you aren't using a VPN then download NordVPN. You can get an exclusive NordVPN deal with the description down below and also it's risk-free with NordVPN's money-back guarantee so you may as well download it and try it out. But yeah that is my plan. I'm going to catch up on the Euphoria episode whilst I get ready and then I think I'm gonna make some breakfast. <laughs> Our food looks so full. reason there is like so much egg um but this looks so good this is definitely my favorite classic go-to lunches i just have some guacamole i put in some chili flakes and pepper a pita cut up and then as you saw a little like mushroom egg omelette type thing it's actually now about 11 30 so i'm having this as like a brunch type thing but it looks so good i love love pita bread and i love guac and i love eggs so i kind of love it all but yeah i'm gonna eat this and then i think me and my dad are gonna go grocery shopping after because we need to get a few more things so yeah i'm just gonna eat my lunch and i'll see you then <laughs> Generate 
Generation X Y. My dad's going oh, hair dye because he's going going grey. Oh, <laughs> Trying to catch some sleep. Buzzing like a neon fleet of broken dreams. And everything that seems is old. So we just finished grocery shopping. Um, yeah, I got some stuff to make some cinnamon rolls for tonight and also some noodles maybe. I might make noodles for dinner tonight. But yeah, I'm gonna head home now and probably gonna do some revision later on the afternoon. But I'm gonna snack on some rice cakes in the car. It's like 5.20 right now. I can't lie, after the 50 minutes of chemistry, I sort of just gave up and like had a nap. And then I walked to one stop and stocked up on Cool Breeze because I literally chew gum like non-stop. But yeah, I kind of got fed up of chemistry. So I'm gonna move on to some maths because I have the maths mock exam on Tuesday and I've revised the first six topics, but I still have, no, I've revised the first five topics, but I still have five more topics to revise. I'm currently doing unit six now. Um, So yeah, not much has really gone on in the last few hours i'm thinking of making dinner in maybe an hour or two hours normally for dinner i'll just eat whatever my parents have cooked but my mom actually had an operation today so she's in hospital till later on tonight she's all good though she's fine it was just an operation on her thyroid i'm not 100 percent sure on what it is but yeah maths and chemistry are both really boring which is really annoying because it just makes it harder for it to revise Sorry, this looks so good. Okay, so I just made myself a gorgeous dinner. It looks so good. I made quite a lot so that I could have some for lunch tomorrow. But yeah, this looks amazing. I also added some like black... I forgot what seeds they're called, but they're like a type of seeds. Just for some texture. I would normally add sesame seeds, but we run out. Okay, I've honestly had quite a lazy like afternoon slash evening, but basically now I'm probably just gonna edit for a bit um, and then I'll come back to you guys when I do something interesting later this evening. Okay, so it's now 20 past midnight. Basically, I had planned for this day to be really productive and then it just wasn't as productive as I hoped it to be. This evening when my mum got home, I basically just sat with her and we watched some TV together. We sort of just talked because for a few days before her operation, she had to self-isolate. So I wasn't really able to like hug her and stuff. So that was nice. And then since then, I've sort of just been on my phone in my bed. But I've said I'm gonna do a face mask at 20 past midnight. I also have athletics tomorrow at like 10 a.m. So I'm gonna be super tired. Um, but it's fine because I fancy doing a bit of self-care. I'm going to be doing the ordinary red peel off face mask because I keep forgetting to use that every week. I know I'm supposed to use it once a week, but I always forget. Yeah, I also still have my makeup on from earlier. I'm just going to do like a de... 
D get ready with me and un get ready with me. I don't really know, but I'm just gonna get unready. And I'm probably gonna head to bed in about 20 minutes. Oh my God, my dark circles are so bad at the moment because I just haven't been sleeping. On Friday, I had my physics mop and I was stressing out so much Thursday night. I was literally up Thursday night, like one in the morning, doing uh, physics past papers because I was so stressed out. And the test wasn't even that bad actually. Like it honestly ends up being better than I thought it would go. But I actually missed a page of questions and I didn't realize till literally the last five minutes. So I'm so glad I checked over my paper. But yeah, tomorrow, as I said, I have athletics in the morning. I think we're doing a lot of running tomorrow as well. We've just been doing a lot of running in athletics in general recently because it's winter season. But yeah, I am actually enjoying athletics. If you've been subscribed to me for a while, you'll know that I used to do cheer and then I quit cheer to do athletics and i've actually like really enjoyed athletics and i'm like happy i did that um but yeah honestly february there hasn't been much going on this month because whole month has just been revision for these mocks i'm sorry about how much i'm talking about these mocks guys um but that's basically all i've been focused on for the last few weeks but as soon as these mocks are over i'm literally like cannot wait i've already started making like post mock plans literally me and carmen were just booking to go to a restaurant um we're going to this place i think i'm gonna go to this place called incognito i think that's how you pronounce it so i'm literally just like looking forward to all the plans i'm gonna do that's gonna happen after mocks that's all i'm thinking of right now um but yeah i'm gonna leave this face mask on for like 10 minutes and then i'll come back but yeah i love you guys and i'll see you in a bit